What is baptism? In simple terms, being baptized is like putting on a wedding ring. It's a response to a loved one and an outward symbol of an inward commitment. Baptism is a way for us to express a personal decision to believe and accept the salvation of God through Jesus Christ. Just as Christ was crucified and buried, we are immersed in water to symbolize the burial of our old ways. And again, just as Christ was raised from the dead, we are also raised out of the water, symbolizing our new life in Christ. The Apostle Paul said it this way, We were therefore buried with him through baptism into death, in order that just as Christ was raised from the dead through the glory of the Father, we too may live a new life. Today we celebrate with people as they take their next step and tell the world how Jesus has changed their lives. My name is Ryan Whited and um, I want to be baptized because um, you know, I want to be different, I want to be changed. Um, you know, I've known God my whole life and i um, always, always been searching for that thing like something's missing and uh, ever since I've um, been going to Grace Church and, and things like that, um, I found out the missing piece is God and uh, I just want to bring Him in my life to um, kind of fill that void. I'm considering myself lucky in, in the fact that I've had uh, two great parents. They raised me in a, in a Christian home. They worked really hard to send me to a Christian school um, and uh, you know I, I believed in God ever since I was little, and I, can, I can't say that I have never not believed in God, but um, I can say that I haven't lived a uh, Christian lifestyle, so to say, um, throughout that time. I've, I've gone to church most Sundays, you know, um, like I said, I believe in God. That's never changed, but I, I never took it seriously. Um, it's definitely been a progression for me. Um, when I met my wife, uh, she grew up in a great family, much like myself, um, and uh, the going to church and um, believing in God and, and you know was was a big thing for me. So I kind of um, pulled her into that. And once we got married, um, you know I, I told her that that was something that was very important for me. Uh, that you know we, we we're a family. We're gonna um, go to church. We're gonna do those things. We. Uh, you know, tried different churches. Uh, we found we found Grace Church, and we liked it a lot. Um, it was different than any other church we'd gone to. And then, you know, we'd been married for a few years. We had our our, uh, our first child, our daughter Kinsley, and uh, that really got the fire lit under me. You know, I I kind of felt like if I was going to be a, a leader of our family, and I was going to you know lead them in, in the church that I needed to get more serious with my relationship with God. For like another year or two after that, we we had kicked around the idea of you know joining a life group. We never really made that jump, and uh, one Sunday we finally decided like let's do it, and uh, we got involved in the life group, and, and that is, has been an awesome experience for us. And I can really say that that. Uh, through that, you know, the relationships we built with those people, what we've learned about God and, and the awesome things we've seen Him do, that really um, you know, made this an important thing to do in my life. He's always been there, and I know that, but I haven't had that personal relationship with Him. And uh, you know, after, after seeing some of our life group members get baptized and, and uh, diving into the Bible, I realized that um, God was speaking to me. and He said, hey, it's, it's, time. it's time for you to get baptized. It's time for... Uh, you to put all your faith in me, and uh, that's what I just when I decided it was time to get baptized. I, I don't know if I would consider my story amazing, but uh, uh, I do think it's important because I think there's a lot of people out there like me that maybe have grown up in, in a church and in a Christian home their whole life and never made that that total commitment to God. You know, they were kind of just uh, cruising through life, much like I was doing, and uh, I think it's important that. Um, you know, anyone who, who sees me out there doing this realizes that, you know, it is, it is important and it, it is life-changing to accept God and, and get baptized and, and start a new life in Him. Jesus is, is my Savior. Uh, he, he came into this world and He paid the ultimate sacrifice for me. Um, he came and He died for me. 
uh, because he loved me. And uh, that's the most important thing that I could ever think of. Ryan, because of your professed faith in Jesus Christ, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Oh God, what an awesome, awesome story. Thank you so much for loving Ryan, for coming into his heart. God, you are always there. It's our response to you that, as, as your word says, compels us, right? It compels us. So thank you for loving us and uh, so thankful for Ryan and his testimony and God that he is leading his family in a way that is centered on you and the way that lifts you up and lives for you. Just pour into him. Lord, I pray that we will continue to put people around him to support him, to give him confidence. Lord, Ryan has what it takes. God, you've given that to him. You've put that in him. Allow him to live with that confidence as he leads his wife and leads his family and uh, leads others in his circle. Lord, that um, you are the light in his life. So thank you for allowing us to be part of that tonight. And uh, we're just so thankful for Ryan. Pray this in Jesus' name. Amen.